Welcome Virgo to your love reading for September 26th and 27th for 2018. Alright, so let's see what's going on in love. And this is what your love issues, love interest or romantic partner might be bringing towards you. Alright, let's see. So they might be offering you to um, work with them. Alright, for some, um, it could be an invitation to um, do something together. Maybe it's like your trying to combine your resources in some way some of you might have children together trying to see how things might go with you and them and others of you this is uh just both of you might be separated as you focus on career so um there might be a new beginning and but also separation between you and them because of financial opportunities so what might your response be so we're going. so you it seems like you might come towards them or you might be around somebody in your vicinity um, some of you might when I see that they might be bringing the energy towards you the page of Pentacles some of you might have a child with them and it could be offering to uh, work so that you two can uh, take care of your child in some way um, it just depends now um, your energy is you being around somebody um, someone that you might be attracted to or with that particular person so it seems like like some of you are reaching out in some way um, so that's it what is their response Virgo. so as you are around them it seems or not for some um, you be you might um, they might disconnect and do something else I feel so it seems like they might be working on something there could be communication and then you two might go your own way um, and if you're not communicate communicating they're doing something else and you get the idea so what might your response be So you're allowing them to kind of do their own thing, all right? You're allowing them to disconnect. If they want to come around, they want to communicate. If they want to open up, okay. If not, you know, so be it kind of thing. That's what I get a sense of. So you might be around a few different people over the next two days, and it might um, be about how to fix something up, a home, how to purchase something, you know, something that you might be involved in to make money. Um, it just depends there. And what is the um, what is the outcome of the connection between you and your love interest for romantic partner for next two days. So uh, mental uh, burnout um, between both of you now. It just depends. I'm not sure someone might have some kind of mental instability that could really bring the other person down. This could be something that you've had some things go on with. Um, it just depends where um, sometimes you might need to go to counseling for some issues or some help. Um, it just depends there. But let's see, the Knight of uh, Cups or which are might be bringing towards them so, that cup, so whoever you might be around um or going towards i feel like there's some good things with you and that particular person whether you realize it or not um there might be some good energy so the will of fortune has been coming out for you for the last couple of weeks though um it doesn't mean that you were you know getting everything that you want but i feel Whoever you might be connecting with, they might serve a purpose in your life romantically um, or have you run into someone that you might not may not have been expecting. So um, just keep that in mind and uh, clarify the Eight of Cups for uh, your partner's or love interest response. Yeah, it seems like they might be dealing with something um, karmically themselves for some. Even if it's legal matters that they're taking care of right now, um, sometimes it's uh, the energy of having a. When I see that, it seems like sometimes they may have done something wrong to someone else, and you're waiting for that energy to clear up. Even something wrong with you when it comes to another person, um, two people, or a child, and so way for some of you out there. So I feel like this is um, something that you might need to uh, just take your time with. Uh, and so let's see messages for well. I'm going to use these for a second. It's not sure these for Virgo. Next two days. Virgo. Hello. So there's some good things coming towards you, I feel, the next two days in love. Um, and love, you know, this is a romantic love reading for those of you who like to connect with somebody or you're dealing with somebody. Um, now, this could involve other people, even friends who you might have love for. Um, not it being in love with them. I mean, like, you know, I love my friend. You know, I really care for them. Family members who you might be around. They could affect you in some kind of way um, right now. So just keep that in mind. So energy for Virgo. So some of you might be a bit stubborn or, you know, a bit um, 
aggressive with someone that you might be dealing with you know especially when it comes to how they might be treating you and letting them know that you might need to focus on career right now you might not be ready that might be an issue between both of you all right and um there might be issues of yeah um either you work with somebody some of you might have some health things health issues that you might be going through or taking care of and someone else that you're dealing with might be going through these things as well which is um something that might be really important that you might need to take your time to uncover or you might know about these things and sometimes that might be the dominating factor of whether or not you can move forward with somebody in a relationship or connection so um keep those things in mind now messages for for the next uh, two years. So we have getting to know each other. It says, as you reveal your animal self to each other, your bond does deepen. So uh, many of you may be uh, getting to know someone. You never know. You know, conversations might pick up and it could be something much deeper as you take your time with somebody. And passion. It says, uh, allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. So um, that's a, a good card. It seems like you might be reaching out to somebody or really um, getting to know somebody. It's 222 right now. Um, so look out for synchronicities, look out for signs, and look out for good things happening as you make changes in your life and you kind of go with the flow and you don't force things to kind of happen. So um, that's your reading. Lots of love, lots of light to you, tons of healing vibes. I wish you the best and uh, have a great day. Great next two dates. <laughs>